welcome, welcome, welcome. Thank you so much for being here on 726, right here in the beautiful downtown Harrison, Arkansas. We're not really downtown, we're up on the hill, but... We can see downtown from here. I can. You know, we put a new tower on our building. So I understand. Did you understand. see that? You well, didn't look up. No. Nobody looks up anymore. I, no. But we've got a, I think it's an 80 foot tower on top of our building and uh, that thing go that ahead. came out, what was well, all that about? Uh, no, you just brought up something that is very prevalent. We don't look up anymore. We don't. When's the last I time agree. you looked at clouds? Okay. I went to this, I went to this thing that uh, my Mary Kay director did and mm -hmm. it was um, we had to be two hours of silence yeah at her place so it allowed you, you that sure. it wasn't that hard it really wasn't but we were in the presence of other people but we did not speak oh really so as I went outside and walked I, I took time to look up you know, because I don't. Because I'm always on the on go, anything. and I wasn't focused on anything else. And it's and always, it really it's always this too. Isn't quite it? awesome. Yeah, it is. Mm. So, I just okay. Thanks mm. for letting me share that. Mm. Well, you're welcome. I have something else to share. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Was that it? <laughs> no. You know, there's this big um, campaign for the ALS. Yeah, and I saw a video challenge. of you get, getting. I did yesterday. get iced. And I also gave money because I don't want people to think that you just go get iced and that's all there is to it. No, we want, they want to bring awareness, but they mm -hmm. need donation money as well. So someone that I did not challenge on my video last night was Dan Reynolds. And I, you consider yourself challenged. Uh, okay. We're going to do it. We're going to do it on the show today. Well, I don't know. The guys we'll do said it they, had a, they said they had a Home Depot bucket. We could okay. do it. Okay. <laughs> Will you do I it? I've got some eyes here. Yeah. Can we like tape it? Sure. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Thanks a lot, snorter. <laughs> I'm not I knew that was hap I knew that was going to happen. You did. It's oh, yeah. later. It's happening. Well, see, I've already, I, 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 I've, already, I've always been, I've already been challenged. Oh, have so you? So I'll have to fulfill that. You didn't do it. You had 24 hours. I, d I was. It, he did it on Friday. I was busy. I was gone. I didn't. Who I challenged didn't, you? Uh, Sco uh, scooter over there in Mountain Home. Scott Callies. He runs okay. the. Um, the, the diner on the square over there. We're good friends, and he challenged actually the entire Reynolds family, the, all the boys. And have that boys done it? <clears throat> yeah, okay. uh, Gil. I don't think Gil has. Maybe that'll be my that, shout can, out challenge. Can, yeah, you should. Anyway, it is for a worthy cause, and if you don't know what ALS is, Lou Gehrig's disease, look it up, and um, a cure would certainly be an awesome thing mm -hmm. to have. But well, I, anyway. I've heard that they they need the research money. I mean, they yeah. they need that to. I mean, to be able to find it's underfunded is right what, and that's why the big push and i understand my son told me they have they have raised quite a bit of money through doing this um challenge and people donating so mm -hmm. so there you have it okay what else lucky you <laughs> okay <laughs> happy Not wednesday well thank you very much you're welcome okay are you doing anything at the like anything uh, singing kind of stuff uh yeah Thunder i've got a couple Pro? couple uh, Performances coming up uh, in October. We're doing a, the uh, Haunted Hayride again down in um, uh, Rivercliff, down there uh, on the Bull Shoals uh, uh, Golf Course. Mm -hmm. I'm doing one okay. on the 24th, and then we are doing one. Um, I had a flyer for uh, Harvest Homecoming. I think this oh, October second. Uh -huh. We're going to be. Uh, it's uh, third, fourth, I think, and we're. It's going to be Saturday. We'll be playing uh, on the square at four, and then we're going to have a street dance that evening so we're going to play and you're again. going to play that mm -hmm. well you when you get the dates you can i've got the flyer it's the, it's uh, it's you've got the, the first weekend of october i think it's the october 4th you think yeah, see when you get the exact dates you can well i'll go out in the, in the middle of the break we'll do okay. that i'll all go right. get the flyer just so we know okay all, all right. right ready uh, yeah we're going to go through the please, lineup let's do we have a great show today tabitha campbell and Shonda Tapley are here, and they are with the Committee for Kids in our community, which if you have not heard about this, I can't, I can't believe anyone in the town couldn't have heard about it by now. So um, they're going to expand on that and tell us about it and tell us why we need it. Um, Chris Parks is here with Century 21 Action Realty. We also have Ginger Milan with the Boone County Library. And mm -hmm. Always something going on there. Absolutely. John Strain and Skip Henricks are here to talk about Vets for Warriors' fourth annual Vets for Warriors charity Corvette rally and Veterans Parade and whatever else is going on during that time frame. And then lastly we have Jet Quick and possibly Tiffany Watkins. I don't know if she'll be here or not to talk about the Bridge Bash 
and Arvis She'll be a surprise Million guest meals. if she shows up. Exactly. She probably got tied up. So, without further ado, we'll go to break, and when we return, we'll be talking with Tabitha Campbell and Shawna Tucker.